फ्रेंड्स माई सेल्फ डॉक्टर राकेश त्रिपाठी एंड यू आर वॉचिंग विद मी डिविजिबिलिटी सो आवर टॉपिक इज टू चेक डिविजिबिलिटी ऑफ नंबर्स सो फर्स्ट वी शेल डिस्कस डिविजिबिलिटी बाय टू फोर एंड एट डिविजिबिलिटी ऑफ दीज थ्री नंबर्स सो अबाउट दिस If a number is divisible by two, it means it should be an even number. So, to check divisibility by two, divisibility by two, divisibility by two, number should be an even number. Number should be. be an even number even number or in other words we can say last digit should be divided by 2 last digit or digit should be divided by Two last means digit at one's place. For example, two sixteen two ninety two. This is divisible by two. This is divisible by two. This is divisible by two hundred because zero is divisible by two. One two seven eight four. This is divisible by two. One two three is not. Why? Because this three is not divisible by two. So divisibility by two number should be an even number, or last digit should be divided by two. And to check divisibility by four, divisibility by four. divisibility by 4 very simple last two digits digits number should be divided by 2 should be divided by 2 divided by 2 for example this 1 2 4 last two digits number formed by last two digits 24 it is it should be divided by 4 4 6 ya 24 2 3 1 6 divided by 4 because last two digits are divided by 16 is divided by 4 3 1 4 6 04 last two digits divided by 4 are divisible by 4 means therefore this number is divisible by 4 but if it is like this 1 2 10 last two digits 10 they are not divisible by 4 10 is not divisible by 4 therefore this is not divisible by 4 and to check divisibility by 8 divisibility by 8 to check divisibility by 8 number formed by last three digits should be divided by should be divided by 8 last three digits last three digits should be divided by 8 for example 791152 this 152 is divisible by 8 therefore this number is divisible by 8 any number like this 2 0 0 8 last 
three digits last three digits are divisible by 8 therefore number is divisible by 8 and another example 5104 see last three digits 104 and if you wish to check you can check divide 100 by 4 by 8 8 1 ja 8 remainder 2 carry over 4 8 3 ja 24 so it is divisible by 8 last three digits therefore the number is divisible by 8 so in this way you may check divisibility by 2 4 8 and very simple for a digit divider should be divisible by 2 in this second to check divisibility with by 4 last two digits should be divisible by 4 and to check divisibility by 8 last three digits should be divisible by 8 next let us check divisibility by 3 and 9 let us check divisibility of 3 and 9 so divisible if a number is divisible by 3 then its sum must be divisible by 3 so to check divisibility of 3 divisibility of divisibility of 3 sum of all digits sum of all digits should be divisible by or should be divided by 3 for example triple 1 see sum of these 1 plus 1 plus 1 3 therefore this is divisible by 3 201 sum of all digits 3 divisible by 2 2 2 sum of all these digits 2 2 2 6 which is divisible by 3 therefore this number is divisible by 3 any such kind of number 1 2 7 8 1 2 7 8 see here 1 plus 2 3 plus 7 10 plus 8 18 18 is divisible by 3 therefore this number is divisible by 3 to check divisibility of divisibility of this number 9 for 9 to check divisibility of 9 number sum of to check divisibility of 9 sum of all digits sum of all digits should be divided by 9 sum of all digits should be divided by 9 for example 81 8 plus 1 9 therefore the number is divisible by 9 1 2 7 8 1 2 7 8 sum of all these we have seen sum of all these is 18 therefore this is divisible by 9 9 0 0 9 sum 9 plus 9 18 therefore the number is divisible by 9 2 3 4 2 plus 3 5 5 plus 4 9 which is divisible by 9 therefore this number is divisible by 9 likewise you may check which number is divisible by 3 or by 9 so for divisibility test for these two numbers 3 and 9 are same their sum must be divisible by 3 or by 9 
for 2, 4 and 8 it is very simple for 2 last digit should be divisible by for 4 last two last two digits should be for 2 last one digit for 4 last two digits for 8 last three digits should be divisible by 8 and for 3 and 9 their sum must be divisible by 3 or by 9 let's move ahead to check divisibility of 6 divisibility of 6 divisibility of 6 divisibility of 6 divisibility so to check any number is divisible by 6 or not we will have to check the number should be divisible by divisible by 2 divisible by 2 and 3 the number should be divisible by 2 and 3 for 2 it should be what an even number and for 3 sum should be divisible divisible by 3 so these two conditions will be combined sum should be an even number and sum of digits sorry number should be an even number number an even number plus and and rather I should write and and sum of digits sum of digits should be divisible by 3 for example 234 234 2 plus 3 5 plus 4 9 their sum is divisible by 3 9 is divisible by 3 and it is an even number because at the first place it is an even number unit place is occupied by even number therefore it is an even number let us consider one more 2 2 2 even this is divisible by 6 because the first thing it is an even number being 2 in unit place and their sum 2 plus 2 plus 2 6 which is divisible by 3 so in this way this is the divisibility test of 6 now let's discuss divisibility of divisibility of 5 and 10 divisibility test of 5 and 10 it is very simple for 5 to check divisibility of this 5 there should be a number whose unit place unit place should have 5 or 0 very simple it is very simple 105 200 10 unit place contains 5 unit place contains 0 305 3005 7120 92135 unit place should have 5 or 0 if it is like this then the number will be divisible by 5 and for the divisibility of 10 unit place should have 0 unit place should have 0 unit place should have 0 like 200 110 7250 and so on so this was the divisibility test of 5 and 10 let's see divisibility test for 6 sorry 7 and 
11. So to check divisibility of a number by 7, we should have a test that suppose if a number is like this, a number of 3 digit x, y, z, a number is like this, then you should multiply this z by 2 means number at the unit place should be multiplied by 2 and should be subtracted from this xy if it is greater than this otherwise we can change interchange their positions let us see see here for example to check its 203 203 then to check divisibility by this number double the number which is at units place means double this 3 and subtract this from 20 see 20 minus 6 20 minus 6 is 14 which is divisible by 7 therefore this number is divisible by this number is divisible by what this number is divisible by 7 let us see another example 159 159 see 159 double this double the digit lying at unit place 2 into 9 minus sign 1515 15, 15 minus 9 to the 18 15 minus 18 it is a negative number so you can change the position means 2 into 9 minus 15 this is 3 not divisible by not divisible by what not divisible by 7 therefore it is not divisible by 7 it is not divisible by 7 another example 109 119 twice this twice of this 18 and 11 minus 18 negative so put 2 into 9 first and 11 at second 2 into 9 18 minus 11 7 therefore it is divisible by 119 is divisible by is divisible by 7 if we have four digit number let us see another case 1652 number is like this x y z w then double this number double this number 2 into 2 and subtract from 165 subtract from x y z like this double the number and subtract from rest of the number x y z minus 2 w see 2 to the 4 165 minus 4 160 1 161 now check is it divisible by 7 or not so you will have to divide 7 to the 14 remainder is 2 121 7 3 the. so this number is divisible by 7 in this way you can check divisibility divisibility by 7 and at the last to check a number is divisible by 11 or not so for divisibility test divisibility test of 11 you should use this concept sum of digits at odd place odd place minus 
sum of digits at even place should be divisible by 11 should be divisible by 11 if it is so then the number will be divisible by 11 otherwise the number will not be divisible by 11 so in this way you can check divisibility by the num by divisibility of the numbers and sum of digits let us see to check divisibility by 11 you can have let's use a number wait for a while let me consider a number even you may consider in the same way Four, five zero one six. This is a number divisible by eleven. So what you need to do? Sum of digits at odd place. This, this. Five plus one six minus sum of digits at even place. Zero plus six six. 6 minus 6 0 and 0 is divisible by 11 therefore it the number this number is divisible by 11 and if we divide this 5 0 1 6 by 11 the outcome is I think 4 5 6 in the same way we can check its divisibility using another case A very big number nine eight five one six nine eight five one six digits at odd places nine five six nine plus five plus six digits at even eight plus one see nine plus five fourteen plus six twenty twenty minus nine eleven 11 is divisible by 11 therefore this number is divisible by 11 and the outcome is 9 sorry 8 9 5 6 divided by 11 sorry the number is 9 8 5 1 6 divided by 11 is 8 9 5 6 8 956 so in this way you can check divisibility of any number 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 and 11 for any kind of problems or doubts you may write to me in comment box do share this video with your friends and let me know your comments Wish you all the best.